Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today's video we have a new video about the 2021 Mazda 3 that we uh, finished complete building it as you guys saw in the previous videos and today we're gonna start our modification for this car. This car is amazing, drives good and everything but I feel like it needs two things. Some more boost, some more performance, some more boost, more performance and it's aggressive look but it can look more aggressive and more bare. So let's crack our first box open and start our modification. Don't forget to like, subscribe to our channel, guys. And let's get the first box. So here we go. That's our first modification. We have uh, an air intake from uh, Burgers Motorsport specifically for this car and that is a stage two that will go all the way down inside uh that uh fender liner on the driver's side and uh we have a cleaning kit we ordered so we can just always keep it the effort to clean uh without the need to replace it with the instruction book to clean it well, we also printed online the whole booklet for the instruction it has instruction for both stage one and two with some pictures so uh, let's go ahead and start it and uh, start pop the hood and I think the first thing we're gonna need to do is disconnect the battery and we'll go from there Okay guys, we have everything installed, uh, looks good, it sounds good, now it sounds like a turbo, and what is gonna make it sounds much better, what we're gonna install next, so stay tuned for that, we're gonna be with you shortly. Um, if you guys wanna see in the steps how to install that air intake, because the instruction is there but it's not really clear, we have a link uh will be in the description we have a detailed instruction how to install the air intake uh all the way so uh let's uh get yeah we, ha we have a full video just how to install the air intake yeah, yeah. we're gonna put the link in the description below and uh let's get to the next step and next modification let's open the box and now we're gonna move to our next step i think you guys will notice what that big box has it's cork sport it's 80 millimeter exhaust it's a cat back exhaust so let's open these boxes that's the membership box so you can get free shipping again the shipping for that for the exhaust was about 80 bucks the membership is a hundred so we did the membership and got the free shipping on the exhaust um, so let's open everything and let's start the install Okay guys, we got everything open here for the exhaust and as you can see, nice finish. <laughs> so that's the 80 uh, millimeter, which is I think 3 point something inches uh, all the way from after cat all the way. Same 3 something yeah, inches, 80 tell. millimeter. So uh, let's go ahead.
Sport exhaust that's our second modification for this car we also have a video with a full detail how to install from A to Z uh, we went over instruction and we like kind of replicated in the video so you guys can see it and if you're interested in do one of these like so you can check the link down below and how to uh, install that cork sport the 80 millimeter which is I think three point something uh, inches exhaust for the sedan ones. Uh, now we're gonna go ahead and move to our next modification for this car. No more performance for now. We're just gonna do some cosmetic changes. So let's open the next box. Okay, check this. We got our first piece for to change that car look to be more aggressive. That's the front lip. It's not a real carbon fiber guys so it's a carbon fiber look it's a plastic so we're gonna find out how to get it all together and installed it should be uh, specific for the mazda as you guys can see here it's a mazda 2020 that's the right side left side in the center piece uh, 2020 is the same as 2021 so now we're gonna go ahead and get assembled and get installed So it's not hard to assemble just like two screws on each side. Uh, now the hardest part or the harder part will be how we're gonna install it in our original bumper. Wow, I love it. It took some time, it took actually four of us at the beginning just to align it and make sure it's the same. You guys gonna have to make sure the space here is the same on the other side same from the top and looks good all the way again is the same here that the same space between the bumper and the lip and also from here so far looks good now we're gonna move to the next box All right, guys, if you can see, we created kind of a groove built in with the new uh, skirt or runners uh, just to hug the mud flaps here. Just an extra support for the uh, new piece. Now we gonna actually start to screw well, just one screw in the bottom to hold that end in place. Then we're gonna adjust the whole thing from the back forward as long as this part this end is adjusted we're gonna adjust everything based on that that's why we spend a little bit time just to get that kind of perfect but you know nothing is perfect um what i like you don't like what you like i don't like you know mm -hmm. it's personal preference if you want that tail like close to the car away from the car far far from the car but um that edge we did that lip we did is i think it's a good idea all right guys that's the final result and i love it it looks beautiful and maybe it's not showing the uh, carbon fiber look but it's right there and i showed you how it looks from the back here's how it looks from the front i think i, I like it i love it 
Uh, now we're gonna move to the other side, do the other side, then we'll be back and we have one more box for this video. Alright guys, we just dropped the car, the other side, oh my god, I love it, I love it. Look great and both sides look the same. Just an idea, it's too much work for, for the purpose, but if you don't like the edge like this, when we're cutting this, you can actually leave that side which is we didn't cut that much by the way we cut like till here maybe an inch and a half or one inch uh, uh, not even an inch not even an inch mm -hmm. then you can actually bend it and leave a piece here bend it down and you just welded plastic weld just to get what to get a box look yeah and come on like <laughs> or the other thing that i saw some people did they just like cut in the middle then they uh, remove, like, remove what they need what to they lose need, then they weld it here in the middle but again it's gonna be like too much work i think it looks good like this with the front lip and everything just my, my point when you're looking from the general look come on it's just here here but if that look bothers you and you're the owner of the car yeah do it i mean it's gonna take Maybe an hour, uh, maybe 45 minutes, but for our purpose, it's good, 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 good. Right. And guess what, guys? Like he said, we have another box to open, mm, and I'm going to go up high here. He's open it right now. Don't forget guys, this car comes with built-in spoiler. Yes, we can take this out. This is a spoiler. Can you take the new yeah, one out? It's a lip. Or... Yeah, it's a lip, but it's a spoiler. So, yes, you can take this out. You're gonna see but... if you're gonna put both or just... Put in our, I, I think in our case, we're gonna put the new one in and we're gonna see how it looks like and just he just rested there. Don't scratch the trunk. Okay. He just rested there and I think it doesn't look that bad. Look at this way. Look at from here. Look at from the top. I don't think it looks bad. Yeah, not bad. Plus you have double function. <laughs> But it looks like the new spoiler actually comes with brake lights. No, it's just a reflection. Oh, just a reflection? Yeah. Oh. Brake light. I thought it's actually a brake light. You can do it later. You can uh, remove this, remove I think. Put some heavy and run some or, wires, but yeah. you're going to make a hole in the trunk. This will make it like battery operated. <laughs> oh, so how are you going to make it battery operated? <laughs> okay, once I get in the car, then turn the flashlight on. <laughs> But I think it looks good. Carbofiber look, which is matches the uh, skirts. There is one piece, guys, that car is gonna be missing. I'm looking. <laughs> we actually for... we have it. No, we don't have. Oh, um, that. I'm looking for a, a full rear diffuser and carbofiber look, uh, in a good price. There is one rear carbon fiber, but it's uh, about three hundred bucks. Uh, if you guys can come and in the comments and let me know if any of you know like uh, a diffuser here uh, for that rear bumper carbon fiber look not that expensive please comment with a link or website or whatever yeah but I have a question to be around the exhaust and holding all that pressure front I don't think it's just gonna be a cheap plastic piece it is. They have him? Okay. Yeah. I'm sorry. I, he does the research. He does the yeah. buying. So... Yeah, that, that's the only piece I didn't get so far. Uh, I'm still going to keep looking, but we have two pieces. Well, that, actually, we have two pieces. Yeah, yeah, we have two pieces that came with a skirt to be here, but so far I don't like how they look. 
I was looking mainly to fill the whole space here with a diffuser that go to the sides as well uh, but if I find like one full or maybe just between the exhaust tip then I'm gonna put the other two pieces uh, but if any of you guys know have an or, idea or yeah, have just, experience with it just put it in the comment below yeah uh, if you know some websites or places to buy it yeah that will help us a lot so let's uh, find out if we're gonna remove the spoiler or just uh, keep it and we'll go from there so we decided to keep the original spoiler, we're gonna put that in front of it and uh, we marked the uh, middle of the spoiler, middle of the trunk or the car then uh, we get like some template with tape in both sides and again the only thing came with it just double side face so that's what we're gonna use, we're gonna apply it to the spoiler then stick it to the place, so let's get that done Check this out guys, after we uh, spent some time <laughs> trying to get the middle Get the center for yeah, center everything. everything together It looks good Look at the side here, it looks perfect Everything's matching in a carbon fiber look For the lip in the front, the side skirt and the spoiler Looks good, looks great And guess what? Always trust your gun <laughs> I mean the heat gun. <laughs> yeah. Not sure how strong that is gonna stay. I feel like I'm gonna drive tomorrow and that will fly. <laughs> no, actually they they last. They last for a long, long time. Yeah. This double face, actually they're strong, <laughs> but just let it rest. Yeah, I'm gonna leave it overnight anyway. I'm not gonna drive till tomorrow morning and uh we'll see if it's gonna fly or not. Let's take a quick look here all the way around. This is the other side. No. Sorry, I like to clean. <laughs> and then all the way to the front. With the mean look. Yep. The most beautiful and aggressive at the same time. And I think that will be it for the Mazda Gold. So, uh, yeah, yeah, I, I think, think that's it. Yeah, the only thing we're gonna need to do is just give it a good wash from outside and inside. And um, after we finish washing, that will be it with the Mazda. It's ready to be driven well, from tomorrow. Come on, morning. what wash? What wash? It's a brand new car. Come on, it's 7,000 miles on it. Just need <laughs> some wash. You know, there's a spot all the way around the car. <laughs> <laughs> just to feel like you, you washed it, your first wash. So, uh, All right, so that's how you get 2021 brand new we, car, yeah. technically. We're gonna uh, might do a video for price reveal. Maybe that will be the last video. Oh, you did not? Yep, we'll give you a... I thought you did. Yeah. Guys, think... guys, seriously, this car, after everything is done to it, for today's value, this car is less than half. Less than 50%. No, actually, it's about 60%. 60? Yeah. Okay. Uh, so, I'm not sure how much he spent because everything is like, okay, I'm going to get a brand new piece. Brand new piece. But believe me, even with the old pieces, we could survive. But... Yeah, it's going to be... I didn't finalize all the calculation, but I think it's going to be around 60%. But come on, guys. It's a clean title car. It's not a salvage, it's not a rebuild title, it's a clean title car. I think that will be our next video. Is we're gonna wash it, take it for a first first drive. Uh, but don't yeah. forget, guys, he got this car 2021. We actually he got it in 2022, so it's one year old car. Yeah. Okay, now we're 2023, but we're working on it. Seven thousand miles on it. Oh my god. Yeah, it's uh, still brand new. Everything feels brand new. Even the smell inside is brand new. Uh, thank you so much, guys, for watching. Please subscribe. 
and uh, like our channel like the videos and uh, we'll see you next video wash the car do a test drive on the uh, actually no for him it's gonna be a crazy test drive and he likes to drive crazy yeah we'll do some price review for you guys have a good one